Well, if you have questions about your credit report or call for action volunteers, they can help with that. They're holding special <laughs> dinner time hours tonight from 5 to 7. Leah Lynchide's here now. She's also going to be sharing live reports tonight on News 3 on what the CFA volunteers can do for you. Before that, though, we woke her up early. So thank you very much. Talk about what we can expect tonight. Love to be here and love to talk about this subject. I love my call for action volunteers. They can do so many different things. We try to do this special call-in every couple of months. You can always catch the volunteers on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays from 11 until 1. But of course, that time frame doesn't always work for folks. So we'd like to open up the phone lines at night and give you a chance to call and see if we can help you solve any problems you might be having with a company. So what kind of problems are we talking about? Oh, it really runs the gamut from small to large. We do some of the stuff you might expect if you think a phone company took advantage of you or a business is overbilling you. Those are some of the common things that volunteers take on. But the scope is much larger. One topic we've actually done a lot of work on is roofing. Now, this is one of my favorite stories. We actually helped a woman out in Janesville with this. A company came out and did such a terrible job roofing Cynthia I box house. Her insurance company wouldn't insure it. Our volunteers did a lot of the behind the scenes work talking with that contractor, but ultimately after we shared her story on News 3, another roofing company came out of the woodwork and replaced her roof for free. When I was a child, my father said you shouldn't draw attention to the good things that you're doing. That should just be a mainstay. And uh, that's exactly what she deserved, was that something was done right. Now, of course, pretty neat that we're inspiring others to get involved and help out, too. But we do get the results ourselves all of the time. Here's one particularly cute story. Roger Kranz had the toughest time with Dish Network, who double billed him by accident. Representatives were unwilling to help him until Call for Action got involved. And then one day there was a knock at his door. And here laid a little box in there and what's this from you know and here it was dish and mrs fields cookies and i opened it up and i couldn't believe it. and then he had this he had this little note in there i love that story too okay a dish executive personally sent him those cookies and gave him his personal cell phone number in case he had any other problems with dish all after cfa volunteers stepped in to help but our main job here is to help mediate and help solve your problems with any company no problem too big or too small so again give us a call i think that's kind of one of those things that a lot of people say oh, it's not that big a deal i can just try and deal with this on my own but in reality i mean they handle all sorts of different kinds of calls oh my gosh from the largest to the smallest we dealt with one thing that we dealt with was a, a student's to college tuition, he got like $10,000 back because his program was canceled. So that's very big. Yeah. But then another one is like a $20 bill that a company wasn't recognizing that our CFA volunteers are working to get off his record. And it's, it's $20. So, I mean, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter how big or small you perceive it to be. We can step in and help. And these are the folks that actually make those phone calls that we all get so frustrated making, you know, when you're put on hold for interminably long period of time. Our volunteers are the ones that will take this on for you. Exactly. So they work Monday, Wednesday, Day and Friday from 11 until 1 usually and you yeah. can hear them in the newsroom making these calls that probably drive us all crazy. I know when I'm calling a company because <laughs> I'm, a return wasn't right. done correctly, it drives yeah. me nuts. These guys are doing the Lord's work out there. I mean, just getting results. And they listen. That's, you know, I mean, I, I remember when I was doing those, there's so much of those people, they just say, no one's ever listened to us before. That's a really good point. They are on the phone. They'll pick up the phone during those hours for anyone. They're going to listen to you and yeah. they're going to pick up your story and they're going to help try and fix it for you. So that's good stuff. Leah Lynchide, thank you. Uh, Leah's uh, special call in. It's going to be the call for action. Volunteers are going to be here from five to seven tonight. That number to call 608-270-2833. Leah's live reports are going to be online as well all throughout News 3 this afternoon and evening. Thanks. Thank you. Good to see you.